Step onto the cosmic stage where worlds collide and imagine a place that's eerily similar to our blue planet. Join us on an extraordinary adventure as we unveil the astonishing secrets of Mars, the red planet that harbors not only a crimson hue, but also a surprising array of Earth-like features. Brace yourself for a mind-bending encounter with the familiar and the alien as we delve into the ten jaw-dropping resemblances between our home and this captivating world. Earth and Mars have a lot in common. They have similar terrain, although Mars lacks the considerable amounts of water, oxygen, and atmospheric pressure required to support life as we know it. Compared to our planet, Mars also has less mass and a smaller size, a bit over half the size of Earth or two times the size of the Moon. These interesting similarities are the reason why many scientists believe that we could one day colonize the red planet. Here are 10 Earth-like things about Mars. 1. Mars has four seasons. Like Earth, Mars has four seasons. Unlike Earth, where each season lasts for three months, the length of Mars's seasons depends on the hemisphere. To be clear, a Martian year has 668.59 sols, Martian solar days, which is equal to about 687 Earth days and is almost twice as long as an Earth year. In the red planet's northern hemisphere, spring lasts for seven Earth months, summer is six Earth months, fall is 5.3 Earth months, and winter is a little over four Earth months. 2. Mars has its own aurora. The colorful aurora lights are not exclusively an earthly thing. An aurora can appear on any planet, provided the conditions are just right. Mars has one too. Although we see colorful lights over here, a human on Mars will not see anything because the Martian aurora gives off ultraviolet light, which is invisible to the human eye. However, researchers were able to observe this light with a special device attached to the Mars Atmosphere and Volatile Evolution Mission, MAVEN spacecraft. 3. A Martian day is barely longer than an Earth day. A day is determined by how long it takes a planet to revolve on its axis. Planets that take longer to complete a revolution have longer days than those with faster revolutions. The length of a day varies greatly on each planet because they all take different times to complete a revolution. On Earth, a day is 24 hours long. On Jupiter, it is 9 hours, 55 minutes, and 29.69 seconds long. On Venus, it is 116 days and 18 hours long. On Mars, it is 24 hours and 40 minutes long. 4. Mars has water. In 2008, NASA's Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter, MRO, discovered water streaming down some slopes on Mars. The water only flows in the summer, which means it is frozen during the colder winter. The Martian summer is much colder than Earth's summer. However, streaks on Mars have been found where temps are above minus 23 degrees Celsius, minus 10 degrees Fahrenheit. Still, you would normally expect to find only frozen water there. So why does the water flow? Scientists are unsure, but they theorize that it occurs because the water has a high salt content. Salty water has a lower freezing point than fresh water and will melt at certain temperatures at which fresh water would remain frozen. 5. Mars has polar ice caps and glaciers. As on Earth, the North and South Poles on Mars are covered in ice caps. However, in the Northern and Southern Hemispheres, Mars also has belts of glaciers at central latitudes. We did not notice the glaciers earlier because they are hidden under a thick layer of dust. The dust could be the reason that the glaciers have not evaporated. Mars has a very low atmospheric pressure, which causes any surface water or ice to evaporate immediately. The ice sublimates from ice to vapor without becoming liquid. 6. Mars has its own falls. By analyzing images taken by NASA's Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter, MRO, we have discovered the existence of a geological wonder akin to a waterfall here on Earth. However, the Mars waterfall is filled with molten rock, lava. The lava spews from four different spots along a 30-kilometer diameter, 19 miles, crater in the Tharsis volcanic province as if it were a waterfall. This happens because lava behaves like water. On the other hand, the lava flows at a much slower rate because it is thicker than water and more susceptible to temperature changes. 7. Mars is the only habitable planet besides Earth. The planets in our solar system are classified as terrestrial planets or gas giants. Terrestrial planets have a rocky surface. We could land on them. They include Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars. Gas giants are filled with poisonous gases. We cannot land on them because they lack a solid surface. 
Gas giants include Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Of all the planets in our solar system, only Earth supports life as far as we know. Mars comes in a close second, while the rest just want to kill us. 8. Mars's landforms may have developed like some islands form on Earth. While rare, it is not uncommon for new islands to suddenly rise from the ocean. In 150 years, we'd have watched three such islands form after underwater volcanic eruptions. The latest and the most interesting is Hunga Tonga Hunga Haape, which suddenly formed off the coast of Tonga in the South Pacific Ocean. The island caught the attention of NASA, which observed its development. NASA expected it to submerge soon after it was formed, but it did not. Now NASA believes that the island will last for several years before finally submerging. 9. Mars might contain life. Although we have not found life on Mars, scientists suspect that the red planet supports or is used to support life. Curiosity, one of the rovers presently exploring the surface of Mars, revealed the existence of organic molecules in some rocks in Gale Crater, which was a lake 3.5 billion years ago. Every living thing contains four organic molecules, proteins, nucleic acids, fats, and carbohydrates. Without them, an organism cannot exist, as we know it. Although the existence of these molecules could point to life on Mars, we know that some non-living things can produce these molecules, rendering the discovery inconclusive. 10. Plants could grow on Mars. NASA believes that we can farm on Mars. In an experiment conducted in partnership with the International Potato Center in Peru, NASA was able to plant potatoes in a special box that replicated the harsh climate of Mars. However, the experiment was inconclusive because researchers used soil from Pampas de la Joya Desert in Peru. While the soil had been sterilized to kill all forms of life, it may have contained some microbes that aided the growth of the plants. As we come to the thrilling conclusion of our expedition through the remarkable similarities between Mars and our own precious Earth, we are left marveling at the cosmic dance of the universe. From the majestic Martian landscapes, reminiscent of our deserts to the tantalizing possibility of ancient water flowing beneath its surface, Mars reveals itself as a captivating celestial neighbor. If you found our video informative, kindly subscribe to our channel so you won't miss out on our videos.